Okay, so hopefully you guys can see a um, difference here. I am currently sitting in my office and I am blonde, if you could tell. So I went and got my hair done and it's okay. I think it looks a little orange, but um, yeah, I'm not, I don't know if I like the color very well, but uh, I got it cut too, if you could tell. So looks like there it was like it was like right it was like right here it was like they cut about that much off so yeah but anyway today I wanted to kind of do a small little haul I know I haven't been doing many of them and I haven't posted a video lately either um so yeah so I'm gonna just do a small little haul um and it's a few things I want to show you um so um, most of it's beauty, but there is some that is um, non-beauty, so I'll show you those as well. So, the first thing I'm going to show you is non-beauty, because there's only three of them. And what I did was I got um, three um, books, and I think I did a book haul once before, um, but I'm not exactly sure. So... I'm going to actually go and see the uh, movie called The Hunger Games. And so I bought the books because people tell me, told me to buy the books first before I go and, um, before I go and watch the movie. So, um, I bought The Hunger Games, the very first one, and, um, let's see, the second one, which is hardback. And you can't find the second and the third book unless it is hardback and I was actually looking for softback and I just didn't find it and then there's the third one and I'm really excited um what I've been told is that when you read these books that um they're very 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 short so they're like short chapters I guess um so they kind of look like this so you know kind of kind of see there that's how big the wording is and so I'm really excited to actually read these books because um, I was watching a trailer on the movie and I was very, very impressed. So I'm very, very excited to read those and I should enjoy those. I will do a review on those books if you'd like me to. If not, then I won't. Or I might, I don't know. It's just, I don't want to ruin the movie plot that people, you know, have, um, not watch, so I don't really want to ruin it, but uh, we will find out. Alright, the second thing I got was, I, and it's, the rest of it's all beauty, so, um, the other one I got is the, oops, okay, sorry, um, it's the Sinful Colors, um, nail polish, and this is in number 101. So you kind of get the idea. And then, um, I've been using that color, well not that color, I've been using that brand for a little while. I have Opion now on, but it's actually shipping pretty bad, so, yeah. So there's that one. And then I went and bought the, uh, the Revlon mask, uh, the Revlon mascara in 001, which is black is black, and I bought the, um, 3D volume photo ready, so... I bought that, um, if you can tell right there, number 001, so I bought that, and, um, I've heard really, I've heard, focus, okay, I've heard some really good reviews about this mascara, and I'm really, um, psyched to actually buy this and try this and see how that goes. Alright, the next thing that I got is I got the Pro Fix, um, Complete 3, so it's got the top coat, the base coat, and nail strengthener, and, um, this is supposed to be a really, really, really good, um, um, like a really good, um, like three in one, so, um, yeah, I'm really excited to try that and see how that goes, so I got that. Then, um, I bought, um, you know, just some bobby pins, so, these are the goody bobby pins for my hair since it's blonde now, and it's, I don't know if you can tell, but there's a black one right there, and you can see it, so I bought some blonde ones. And then I bought the L'Oreal Carbon Black Lenore Intense Felt Tip Liquid Eyeliner, and this is in $6.90, so, um, I bought this, 